<laughs> he said, Ash, resilience, finding your limit. Number 21. Seven, 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 guys. It's in case if it's a joke thing, yeah? Right, so... <clears throat> I want to time stamp them. Very important that I do that because I want to cut them, you see. You will cut it. So, for those of you who keep seeing 777, this is because you are resilient, you're brave, you are strong, you are... Hmm. I don't know if it's a dog, you know, or it's a dragon energy, but let's get it first before we just waste my time, yeah? <clears throat> Congratulations, I mean, and let me know, let, like, please comment below, let me know if you, if you feel the end, the numbers on them, and like, it's, it's more than numbers to you, like. You're just like, why Why am I feeling like that? Just seeing this number. Let me know. That's how I feel. So I feel like I'm supposed to be doing something, but we just, just get irritated by it. <laughs> we just, just be like, oh my God, yes, me know me have a twin flame. I know it's flaming. What am I for do now? That kind of thing. And that's not right. But I just tell me that's what I do because sometimes, you know, I'm in denial. Sometimes I'm not perfect. It said finding your limits, resilience, energy, right? All right, this is a dog. I didn't want to say it yet because I, I was like, I don't know. Look like a wolf, but it's a dog. So loyalty it says enough is enough. This is a message from the dragon to the human, right? There comes a time when the fire within us burns brightly with an intuition shouting forth. It is time. It is time. It is time to know when to quit. Baby, it's cold outside. Look within you for your inner warmth and knowledge of self. Set your boundaries. Know your limits. Find what works out for you right now. The outside world is irrelevant. The entire universe resides in you. It's time to stop. Take fuck if you keep seeing 777, seven, seven, my love. All right, well, I, I don't know. I don't remember seeing that, but I may see one bag of 11, 11, 4, 4, 4, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3, 3. I see that a lot. So if you're seeing 7, 7, 7, it's 21 here, yeah? It's time to stop taking the bullshit. Know your limits. Find what works for you. Now, limits were made to be surpassed and finished. Lines were made to be crossed. You get me. You know your limits, but after a certain point, you will re-emerge to tackle a new challenge, stronger and better than before. You will bounce back. You are resilient. It is time to push to the limit and beyond. But I don't know. I feel this. I bought something. All them <laughs> different exercise things. I'm fine with this. We need more exercise. <laughs> something to make me real tired, yo. <laughs> I'm feeling that. So it's the setting boundaries and knowing your limit. When to say when. When to require a lot of, of, of self-reflection. When to require meditation. Take the time out of your day to establish what works for you. So when you see 777, remember, like, the most important thing is you. The whole universe, Jesus Christ, if you're a Christian, is inside you. Is not inside me. So you're supposed to have real responsibility how you carry the Christ energy. You know what I mean? It's all about you. And you're supposed to feel that. Step in, raise her, however. However you feel. You understand? You want to get this. Listen to your inner voice, right? Establish what works for you. Once you have established your stance and retreated to safety, then you can bounce back better than ever with resiliency, power, and grace. It is about retreating within and getting right back on the playing field when the time comes. That's how you get to be unstoppable. So it looks like you have to get something off of your mind. It's not saying to go to war, but it's saying enough is enough. Like stop taking the bullshit. It's time to walk away. 
um, there comes a time when the fire burns within brightly and there comes a time when the, when the, the fire shouting forth its time. When your mind telling you it's time. Baby, it's cold outside. Look within for the inner strength and the inner warmth and the knowledge of self. Set your boundaries. Know your limits. You understand? No, no, no. For example, when the phone rings a certain time, know who you are. Ah. No, who you answer on the night and who you not answer. And who you just not answer. Okay, let's not try that again. Yeah? Stuff like that. But let's see. <clears throat> Good morning. Grand Rising Royals. My name is Shwanaya. We are over here in Wolverhampton. My kitchen is getting a whole new painting and it looks so different. The man cleaned the place proper like a Caribbean somebody. Yeah. I feel good about it. We're not finished yet, but my house is getting a mildew clean up. And I feel happy. Every demon and their grandmother gone. Now, let's see what this is about. I mean, resilience. Wow. Seven of ones, my love. The eight of ones. So, love who you love. I mean, as long as it's not some, you know. What the moon is exposing these days, does pedophilia? Because that's what I go go on. There'll be more next year. Now I have no makeup, guys. Anyway. It says challenge and competition. Protect yourself from them. They won't like you. But let's see. Somebody defending you because they're in love. Yeah, so this, this, okay, so you have to fight for them too. Do you like it the way you like to spend my life with you? Fight for love, fight for love. Massacre, fight for us. Oh, wow, maybe it's an Aries. Hmm. Obsessed with being the twin flame. Let's drink to that. Cheers to that freaking weekend. Drink to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, we only apply in the tarot with knowledge and wisdom, with the advice. That's how we're reading it. It's not, don't come off track. We are intellectuals, right? It says, enough is enough. There comes a time when the fire within burns brightly. When your intuition telling you it's time, time to know when to quit, please, because this is a demon here who will never stop fighting with you about you because it's like you are, you have what they want. So when you see the seven, 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 it's time to just laugh after them because them are time, them are away. So something like that, what the song say? Somebody want to challenge you forever. Yeah. Seven of ones, wheel of fortune. Five of ones. I'm going to be better than you. I don't care what you do. I'm younger. I'm older. I'm fatter. I'm slimmer. For the rest of my life, cycles and destiny. I'm going to be your competition. You have to protect yourself from me. Because I'm petty. I'm egotistic. I want to cause strife. I'm the rival. So the dragon saying straight out, 777, seven, seven. when you see that, just don't fight with them, yo. It's a waste of time because they're not going to give up. So somebody strategically want to drain your energy. <laughs> and the destiny angel, this day collecting the information. This is ridiculous, but... Mm. I want to do them, I want to do them, them, them. Okay, that's what the music say. Five of ones. Ace of Pentacles, because you probably getting some opportunity. Ten of Cups, wow. I would have fight for that too. If it was me, me would have jealous. Wheel of Fortune. Mm. You see? I'm too good at this. Page of Pentacles in reverse. With Knight of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody study your life, babes. Those of you who keep seeing the 777. King of Swords. What did I say? Somebody study your life. Study who they are in the energy. 
Like they study who they are in you or whatever. And they, they know that if they keep fighting with you, then it's going to make you lose money. Look what somebody plan to be for the rest of their life. A blocker. A blocker. Yeah, bad news. Earthly matters. Lack of common sense. I told you, it's the enemy. <laughs> oh my God. Seven of ones. Seven of pentacles with the ten of... Well, 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 well. well. You have the ace of pentacles with the ten of cups. You have the seven of pentacles with the ten of pentacles. They're not having it. They obsess you with your success. Seven of ones, four of... <laughs> oh, God, seven of, seven of swords, four of ones, six of swords. Can I get kicked out? Maybe, maybe, maybe somebody chose you and not them because seven, seven, seven is not bad, you know. It's, it's jackpot. It's money. Ten of pentacles, ten of cups. And that's what's causing the fight and the strife. So let's go again. We love advice. It's time to quit, yeah? Um, look within for the inner warmth and knowledge of self. Set your boundaries. Like, for example, we need to set spiritual boundaries. Because this is a person who feels they have major arcana energy in a your vibe. So maybe your person like them too much. Because you don't want to harm here. Not unless it's your person. Not unless, let's take it another way. you fighting with the person you live with. And they just plan to bring you bad luck because you don't choose them or something like that. This is a person who plan to bring you bad luck. So if it's not, where is that thing? If it's not... <laughs> Seven of ones. <laughs> I don't like to. Yeah, the snake. Okay, thank you. I don't like to. When I get frustrated, I just, just stop talking. Because it's too much sound in my head at one time. You don't know what I expect me to do. We can only take one at a time, so we just don't take none. <laughs> and then it usually comes out in this, because I stop, I stop listening to, the, to them. <laughs> yeah, it's what I go on. It's the other woman. So it, let's the thanks for that. So let's... I love reading dragon energy because dragon they don't even have time neither. Cause I know. I mean, I know, at, that, at them first, no, no time. So we're good. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> that was frustrating. <laughs> yeah, the other woman look over your shoulder. Like, same, same shit, different day, guys. So if you see in 777, this person is just jealous of how patient you are. But what I was saying is that they have major kind of energy, major kind of feelings about you. So maybe your person give them too much power or that they say. Maybe they, they have the thing twisted in their head because somebody actually feel that they can be this forever. So it means that they plan to be your person forever. <laughs> and that's what I go on, yeah? Like somebody cement their self as a karmic in your energy, like this is how it's going to be. And the dragon say, no man, drop them. It's not saying drop your person, though. It says set boundaries, right? So I was saying spiritual boundaries. Maybe you can't sleep with them. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Like maybe, maybe when you, let's say you're going to meet them wherever you plan to meet. And then you, you uh, when, the, when the train go to stop. You see 777. <laughs> you understand? So you're supposed to know straight. Bumbo clot. This person is going to be fighting me. So like for example. If anything bad happen. Uh, I'm not going to be surprised. Because I see when I. Like when I'm moving on the street. I see 11, 11 all the time. But it's always exciting. It's always like oh my god. So but if it's a bad feeling. You're going to know. Maybe it's that. Somebody plan to be a permanent spokes in your wheel, in your, in your bicycle tire, my love. Like, so maybe they, they feel like they know your person. And I'm telling you guys, this is the age of Aquarius. These are not the days to just assume that we know people. Never feel like you can predict a person. Just do like me. I always feel that you just need to go and go your way on your side. You just don't know tomorrow. Yeah, I always tell myself that. I always tell myself, like, when I get up, when I go outside, I might meet the next one I'm going to marry. <laughs> I might just meet somebody I can just tell everything. 
So, I, so then I don't feel codependent and stuff. I me never tell myself me gonna be it. Me, me never tell myself me gonna get picky. Yo. I always tell myself it's gonna work out. Don't don't tell yourself like what this person tell yourself they're going to be a permanent. Like for example, they don't they don't plan for you to have nobody else other than this person who 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 they 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 fucking around or fooling around that they feel that it's it's a devil, right? The devil with the emperor. Very controlling person. They want to control everything. They want to control your person energy. They want to control your energy. They want to feed on the union. So I guess you guys probably look up. Of course, you're powerful because you see in synchronicity, right? So you have good energy that people want to feed on. A lot of people don't understand that. So maybe they feel like you're going to stay. You don't know. Maybe they feel like your person not going to ascend. Me, <laughs> don't know. Don't do that, guys. Don't do that. People are saying every day. Never. It's better you be humble and take yourself out and say, My God, maybe this is happening to me because I'm not supposed to be here. Let me just come in on my corner. Let me just chill. What God have for me, no man can take away. So if this is not working, maybe this is God not have it for me. Let me go in on my corner. Let me sit down. You cry to look at tears or <laughs> something and you give thanks for the knowledge and the wisdom because this is the age of Aquarius. You don't walk around like this fool. Yeah, them, let's get the word. They had to collapse too because they plan to be negative forever. So, you don't win already. Without even fighting. It's 5.21 a.m. 